Hello everyone, today I'm going to present you a video tutorial about how to use Slatebox, which is a website where you can create amazing mind maps for your students. In order to go first, you need to type slatebox.com and go to the website. On slatebox.com, you can use the website as a guest member or you can sign up. I already have an account. I'm going to just log in to the website. On the main page, you can see your already created slates. You can check your teams with whom you have created slates before. You can manage your profile. You can check templates, themes, or slates created by other members of the website. In order to create a new slate, just go on top of the page and click New Slate, which will direct you to a new page. This is going to be the actual working place. These are called the node where you are going to work on. And you can just resize your node or you can rotate your node or you can add a new node to create the mind map. If you want to add a new node, just click on the plus icon and a new, a new node would appear. You can change many things about a node. And here you go. This is a mind map. If you want to add a new node, you just need to click on the plus icon, which will give you a new node. You can break the connection between the nodes, or you can add connection between the nodes. When you click on the delete icon, it will break the connection between the nodes. If you want to reconnect the nodes, you can just click on this icon and drag it to the node that you want to connect it. You can type something in your node. And you can change the font of your text you can change the color of your text you can change everything about almost everything about your note for instance you can change the size of your note if you double click on your note you can change the color of the note and you can apply this to all the other notes you can change the shape of your note when you click on a different shape, the node, the, the color of your node is going to change. Just double click on it again and you can change the effect of your node. Or you can lock your node and you do many other changes on your node. When you are done creating your slate, you can easily manage your slate. You can add a new title to your node, which can be node one. You can describe your node. You can show grid, or if you don't want to show grid, you can just turn off. You can change the themes of your node. You can change the slate color. You can generate note colors here. You can add your slate to the website. Or if you have a website already, you can add it to your new website. You can export your note. You can download it. And when you're done creating your slate, just it saves automatically. And when you click on my slates, it will direct you to your created slate.
If you want to copy a slate, just click on three dots that you can choose copy the slate. Or if you want to delete the slate, you can delete it. And if you don't want it to be seen by the public, by the other members, you can just make it private. If you make it private, a private icon will appear here and other members of the website will not be able to see it or your students cannot be, cannot see it or it won't be uh, visible to your students. So you must make it public again if you want this slate to be seen by the public, which means by your students. And if you want to, you can make a copy of your slate and you can delete it easily. That's all about slatebox.com. Thanks for watching.